Hey Empress, hey Empresses, how are y'all doing today? This video is going to be for Capricorn, Summer, Rising, Venus, and North Node. Capricorn, guess what? We in 10K. We did it. <laughs> we did it. You, me, and Father God, we did it. Father God got us on the up and up, yo. We on the up and up. <laughs> God is so good. I just want to say thank you. Thank you for all the love, the support. Thank y'all. Thank you. I'm sending you on abundance of peace, love, and life always. If you are new here, welcome. Thank you so much for joining me on my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. First things first, I only have one YouTube page, one Instagram page. Don't get scammed, okay? At Mecca Dreams. You can only book a personal reading with me using my website, which will be listed down below in the description box. Let's begin. Angels, ancestors, spirit guides of the highest white light, please come down and protect me. Please come down and give me clear messages. Ooh. That doesn't belong in the set. Straight from the divine. Archangel Michael. But I saw another one. Holy Spirit. Ooh, there's a few of them that don't belong in here. It's from the other deck, y'all, that I used. Archangel Michael, Holy Spirit, please come down and protect me, guide me, and keep me safe. And please come down and protect and cover the viewers that have clicked on this video today. What are the messages today for? Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. <coughs> oh, what is Capricorn? You should know Capricorn. There's some things that you have to say. Okay, you, have, you could be having to say things to people, and it could be hard. Okay, you could be, I'm here, let me. <laughs> the old school is so hard. <laughs> I'm here, let me clear my throat. Let me clear my throat. Y'all could be dancers, entertainers. Somebody could, you, they could be clearing your throat and they're saying something very serious and it could be taking somebody off guard. Whatever you're about to say, whatever you're saying, whatever somebody has to say to you, it's very serious. It's going to take somebody off guard. Yeah, stay focused at this time. Okay, it's really important for you to remember why you started this journey. Okay. Yeah, things are being hidden from you. Cancer energy. Things are not what they appear to be at this time with the moon card. Not everything is what it appears to be. Things are are being misconstrued at this time. Somebody here is making you believe one thing and it's really another. And it's important for you to trust your intuition and your discernment to see past these illusions. Okay, yeah. Something about you choosing a brand new direction. Grasshoppers could be significant as well. You're choosing a brand new direction though. Something, one direction that you were going towards, it's like it had you stuck, stopped, stagnated. It, it had you capped. Okay, it's like you couldn't go any further. So you have to, it's something new. Somebody here, yeah, it's a karmic air sign around you. Be mindful of it. It could be a, a Cancer or a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Leo is here. God's going to make sure you see the truth about this as well. Somebody wants you to, they don't want you to be able to communicate. Air is all about communication as well. They don't want you to be able to understand something or speak out or, wow, see, see the truth about something. Gain some type of information that you need that's going to help you gain knowledge as well. Somebody here doesn't want you to do this. But God is going to make sure that it happens for you with the sun. It's like it's going to come to you anyway, yeah, because your vision is meant to be clear. Yeah. Uh-huh. You're a star. Okay, very powerful, very unique, very loved by Father God. There you go. Earth energy, Capricorn. This could also be this around you, Taurus. Another Capricorn, another Capricorn or Virgo could be significant. Aquarius is here as well. Yeah, you're a star for something that you do. Something about your authenticity, okay? Your your faith, your obedience to Father God. You could be praying. This is just your faith. Okay, your faith being restored. Your faith being renewed with the star card. Wow, you're connecting to up above. It's like your vision is clear. You get straight downloads from up above. Mm-hmm. 414, as I say this, wow, wow, you have clear vision <laughs> and you have, it's like you're, you, things are clearing up for you. I don't know if you were confused or conflicted or you were in a situation where it was you were in the dark, you weren't, able, you weren't able to see the truth out of it. You're going to be able to see the truth out of it, Capricorn, okay? Something is coming out, okay? Finding out, you're going to find something out. Something is coming to the light for you so that your vision could be clear. Something, it's going to be a realization, something could could be about wine glasses as well. Y'all could be really fancy. I'm here, not fancy, huh? Fancy, huh? So these could be significant. Fancy, huh? Mm -mm. Nails done, hair done, everything done. Nails done. I think that's how it goes. I'm fancy, huh? So you could drink water out of cups, out of like wine. Y'all yeah, very fancy. Ooh, I'm here in bougie. Mm -mm. <laughs> people could people could look at y'all. 
Like y'all take good care of yourselves, okay? And it could be making people upset. Yeah, can't make it up. <laughs> There's a drama queen around you. Somebody is chaotic, drama filled. They're watching you, stalking you online as well. They want to find out something about you. They can even be trying to like gang stalk you, harass you online. They're trying to find out something online about your records as well. Somebody here's trying to search you online. Yeah, they're trying to use tarot. They're getting readings done on you. This is my tarot card. Okay, and it's because they want to know. Somebody here wants to know. Wow, they be mindful. Somebody here is playing in your dream state. I have to say that too. Somebody here is playing on a, um, a deeper level. They're playing on in the spiritual realm. The moon, the drama queen, and the tarot card. They use it. Mm-hmm. Somebody here is using tarot to try to figure out like how they can throw you a tax, especially while you sleep. And it's about it's around this um, full moon energy as well. Somebody here could have did this around the full moon, could have sent you some type of attack. Okay, and it's because of things that you're praying about, you're manifesting into your life, things that you're yearning for. This is a karmic. I just yeah. It could have been a third party situation. You could be in a karmic situation with someone. They could have put you in a third party situation. It was a lesson that was needed with this individual. Okay, somebody here is on your tail. They're on hot pursuit. They're on hot pursuit of you. They're watching you online. It's really important for you to cleanse your space, cleanse your aura. Be mindful who you're talking to at this time, Capricorn. <clears throat> we about to get to the tower. Yeah, because somebody here got with someone here that they weren't supposed to be with, or you could have gotten with someone that you knew you were just supposed to be with. It was a toxic situation, and now things are coming out, and it could be coming out very rapidly, and someone's pissed off about it. Someone here wants to start upheaval with you yet because they could feel rejected that something is wrapped up over. This could be definitely online with the world card. It's my online card, okay? This is like, um, what is this? Scorpio, Taurus, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Leo, Leo energy. Somebody feels rejected. You could have rejected somebody online. Something was public. Something could have been a public embarrassment. Okay, somebody here saw something online. They could they could feel like you are just, you know, over a situation. You're not dealing with it. You're letting something go. Somebody here doesn't like that, that you could be cleansing your space and your aura. You're coming out on top because of it. Or this is what you need to do. You're removing negativity around you. Yeah, somebody angry. It's an air sign that's pissed off about this, a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. I cannot make it up because you rejected something. There goes that moon card again, y'all. Sorry, guys. That's necessary. With the moon, the moon twice, you guys really need to trust your intuition about things being hidden. You may already know that things are being hidden from you, and it's like, don't doubt it. Things are being hidden from you, and it's like, things are still not, wow. It's like, wow, not everything is out yet, too. With the moon, it's coming out, like, twice. Things are still being hidden. It's like you guys may think you know the truth of a full situation. Y'all don't. Things are still being hidden. Things are still needing to be uncovered. Or Father God still is like holding up things from, from you being able to find things out of a situation. There's too many it's hidden energy here. Somebody's cloaking their energy. They're really much deep in their emotions as well. They're like, they're drowning in their emotions with the four of cups because they feel rejected. That was the nine of pentacles I wanted to pop out. And it's because you could be choosing to be single independent take care of yourself yeah you could be choosing to focus on you with the four of pentacles you're holding back from someone it could be a virgo or another earth sign it could even be a water sign for some of y'all what's this four of pentacles yeah you're holding back from someone's manifestation somebody's trying to call you towards them and they're trying to use all they might to do it all they will to call you towards them to get things from you but you are holding on to things for dear life and that's what you need to do with the the four of pentacles wow 44 is here as well that angel number could be significant. Somebody here could be born in April. April 4th could be significant. 4-4 four, four could be significant. Somebody could be 44. Yeah, with the three of pentacles here. Somebody here wanted you to like not be able to work together with different people that could have helped you, that can help you, people that you're meant to collaborate with, network with. People that are meant to get to know you and the skills that you are that you bring to the table. Somebody here didn't want you to see this, but your strong will overcame it. Yeah, you intimidated somebody with the nine of wands. They didn't understand that you are a beast. Like, wow, you not only know how to tame yourself, but you know how to like tame others in different ways. You taming yourself is like putting other people in like a place of having to tame, you know, their 
their selves in different ways with the strength card, you're able to overcome obstacles, strife, and people didn't realize how confident, how strong you are. Yeah, you left somebody out in the cold with the five of pentacles. Your emotions became more grounded as well in regards to a situation. Something here you were able to overcome and hold back from. But somebody here did not want you to. They were even working together with different people to try to hold things back from you. But just like you stand on your own. Something told you to reject something. Somebody here wanted you to feel rejected in different ways. They also wanted you to miss out on opportunities that were coming towards you because they wanted you to be at a place of poverty like them. They could have even been working together with somebody here. Now, both of these people are in a place of hardships with the five of pentacles, job loss, mm. financial destitution, not being able to pay their bills. Somebody here is hurting, feeling financially left out on the cold from their higher self, mm. emotionally left, left out on the cold from their higher self. Financially left out in the cold. Yeah, literally. They're not connected to their north node. Somebody here is stuck in their south node. They're not able to connect. Like, they're not able to hear the, their their angels, their ancestors clearly in regards to what direction that's going to bring them financial success. Somebody here is blocked. I'm hearing they're spiritually blocked. They did something with Tarot and God said, oh, woo, somebody here found this out in the reading or they found this out with Tarot. They found out. It's going to blow up. It's, it's a blow up here. Somebody here is getting ready to be exposed. It was a backfire with the Tower Scorpio energy. Somebody here is like, ooh, exposed. Something was toxic and God is destroying it. It's going to be a divine revelation. Epiphany 5-5 five, five is here as well. Major changes are taking place with the Five of Cups. Yeah, you intuitively know this high priestess. Pisces energy, Leo is here with the strength card. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn is here. Another Capricorn could be significant, could be significant or a Pisces. But yeah, somebody here feels regretful. They feel like, damn, they cannot change the situation because you know it all. You you may like you could be a seer, very intuitive, an empath. Okay, you get you know hidden knowledge. You get messages straight from up above and someone here is like, they can't play you. Five of Cups, it puts them at a place of remorse and regret over this because you know, they know you're moving away. Yeah, this is someone who you definitely could have celebrated with, partied with, drunk with, collaborated with. Yeah, you're choosing you. The Nine of Pentacles, you're standing on your own now and it's putting somebody in a place of shame. Stress, emotional discontentment, not being happy. Someone here is not happy because this was someone that you were giving to at one point in time blindly. Like, you didn't think about it. Six of Pentacles, you just gave, and somebody here is real. Yeah, the star, and it's because you just had it. Yeah, it's like you got, mm, there was a lesson y'all needed to learn in regards to, like, being reckless or careless, especially in regards to, like, showing off. Somebody here wanted you to show off, show out. They wanted you to be very reckless or careless. Yeah, they wanted you to be confused. Somebody here, oh, ooh, somebody here also wanted... Yeah, somebody here wanted people to view you as a knight of wands individual. Wow, but you're the empress. Like, can I make it up? Yeah, because you're very attractive. Queen of wands, you're very sexy. You're very daring. It's like, you look good. You're very confident. Yeah, with the seven of cups, somebody here wanted you to be, like, people to be confused about you. They also wanted you to be in a state of confusion. But everything is fine. It's like things are looking up for you because of your 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 confidence, your spunk, you, you being able to free yourself. Yeah. This is you bossing up, male or female. Wow, the Empress of the King of Swords. Damn. Male or female, y'all are in your energy. Y'all not taking no mess. Mm -mm. This could have even been a situation where y'all had to get a lawyer. Okay, y'all could be talking to your father. Y'all could have got a lawyer. Y'all could have got someone who's in a place of power. Okay, it's like someone here means business at this time. This also could have been a situation where you were dealing with someone who you were married to. A father figure. They could have children. They could be divorced at this time or getting ready to be. You could be going through a divorce with somebody here. And there's a court situation that's getting ready to be handled out in your favor or in, in a in a place where things are gonna be balanced. It's gonna be fair. It's gonna be right. What's this King of Swords? Yeah, somebody here wanted you to go back and forth about you being direct and speaking the truth. They wanted to keep you in a place of drama. It could have been an air sign doing this. The two of pentacles, it even could have been two men doing this against you. Yeah, the five of swords, because they wanted you to feel defeated or someone here wanted you to feel defeated. Like you weren't going to be able to boss up or take control of your life. It brings stability, structure, the emperor. Yeah, be mindful. This could be an Aries or Taurus for some of you guys. Somebody here also could have teamed up. They could have like talked to their friend if this isn't the same person. 
okay, with the emperor and the king of swords, it could just be the same person. Somebody just very mean, militant. They don't really care about love. They mostly just care about what benefits them. <clears throat> Somebody here was going back and forth about how they were going to get you to feel defeated with the two of pentacles and the five of swords. Somebody here was like really trying to play on your intelligence and they want to come in and bring you burdens. You need to be mindful. But some of y'all, it could be two different people doing this coming towards you. One's trying to put you in an off-balance situation where you're being juggled. And the other one, the love offer is just going to bring you complete stress. One could be a father figure. One could be like going through a divorce or they're just closed off to love at this time. Or this could be the same person for some of you guys. This person is very closed off to love. They, they don't want to bring you, you know, happiness at this time. Somebody here is very much focused on themselves. Okay. But they want like your energy with the eight of wands. You need to be mindful of this. Yeah. It's going to, ooh, it's going to backfire in their face. Confirmation. It's going to backfire. Yeah. Because you're going to be guided away from this. Yeah. You too boss for that. <laughs> your wife or a husband. And it's about your financial security. And somebody here, there's like two people or one person trying to come towards you because of it. But it's going to backfire. It's not going to work the way that they thought. The plan is not going to happen. It's going to be destroyed. Something is, was being built on a fake and faulty foundation. It's going to crumble. You're, move, you're, you're being guided to a way calmer place. Okay, it's like you're being protected. Your angels and your ancestors are covering you. They're moving you away. Hope this helped you. May peace and blessings be to you always. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. And now I'm sending you the money for peace, love, and light. I will be seeing you on the next video.